half k to the one half, right? The Cobb Douglas. K is 121. Target output is Q1. And I'm trying to find conditional factor demand for labor. All right, so in this case, I'm not looking at the cost, just uh, trying to figure out how much labor should I purchase if I'm trying to produce some general target of Q1 units of output. So what I can do first is plug K into the production function. So I have Q equals 0 0.1 L to the one half. I don't know what L is, um, but I do know what K is. K is 121. And I'm taking that to the power one half, it says in the production function. So I plugged in K, <clears throat> can simplify that. 0 0.1 times L to the one half. Square root of 121 is 11, right? So 0 0.1 times 11 is what? Is that 1.1? 1 .1? Can you guys correct me if I'm wrong? How's that look? Good. All right, so now what? So I'm trying to solve for L. What would be the L that would give me that target? So the idea is you have a target over here on the left side, like 90 units or whatever. And so I'm trying to figure out what L is. So if I divide both sides by 1.1, you have L to the one half. And let me just put that... Uh, decimal form. So 1 divided by 1.1 is 0 0.909. And then to isolate L by itself there, L to the power 1, I can just square both sides. So I think that becomes 0. Point there's some rounding, eight, three, something like that. Q1 squared, I think. So you square a Q and you score 0 0.909. So that'd be my conditional factor demand for labor. That's good. All right, so. So what I want to do tonight is just show you the long run 